Okay, it wasn't our topic today. Oddball situations is our topic, but I've got my number 22 hat on because irritability has got me by the throat. And number 22, I have to tell you, is pretty fabulous in her own right. She really is. And I was talking to Gil in a thread in MLPA and Men O Pause Anonymous, if you don't know. And um, hang on. <laughs> she said <clears throat> it felt good to give them both barrels politely. And what number 22 does for you once you can get a handle on her, and I call her her because she's the bitch of menopause. She seriously is. She gives you the opportunity to be able to be a powerful woman and not be a doormat and strike like a cobra <laughs> with politeness and leave them with a sting that they'll think about later. Seriously. Um, our son said to me this morning when I told him that Jerry didn't want me to go to the post office with him, he said it's because you caused trouble. No, it's not that I cause trouble. I'm very, I'm not rude <clears throat> about it, but it's like do your job. Do your job. We're, you're, if you try to deliver something very important and you don't leave, a note saying you tried to deliver it, you just decide to return it to the sender. And they do this all the time. We have watched out of our window the, him come up to our, our mailbox and not get out of the car to deliver a package, but put our mail in. So Jerry will walk to the mailbox and he has to loop around the mailman to come back on the other side. And we'll find a note in there occasionally saying, you know, I tried to deliver something. No, you didn't. We were home. We were home. You didn't try to deliver anything. And Jerry will wait for him on the other side of the street. And come on, do your job. Get out of your vehicle and come and ring our doorbell. And don't knock on it ever so lightly when there is a doorbell there. Okay. That's my problem today. That's my problem. So for all of you <clears throat> that are experiencing number 22 this festive season, breathe. Breathe. Who said to breathe? Joan said to breathe. Breathe, breathe, breathe. And know that this too shall pass. Love you all.